one for men? <sighs> I saw him again last night. Ooh, what'd you guys do? We were on a picnic blanket and he was about to kiss me. And then I woke up. Oh, it's time for our coffee break. I guess I could use a mocha. so complete. You do realize he's just a dream, right? But what if he's not? What if he's real and he's looking for me too? Yeah, what if? What if I was Angelina Jolie in a parallel universe? And how do we know that dreams aren't real? I, I, how else do you explain why I feel so close to him? You're really a horny, that's how? How long has it been since- I'm gonna tell you something that I haven't told anyone else before. Hit me. Before you came to R&D, I really didn't have that many friends. And then one night I had this dream about this new girl that got hired and we really hit it off. And then the next day, voila, you got hired. Hmm. In that case, why don't you start dreaming of me with that cute Fendi handbag? Kate, Mocha, Heather, black coffee. It's this new app. It notifies me whenever a possible match registers on the site. Cool. Now can I have my coffee, please? See, this kind of looks like him. How was your date last night? You didn't even tell me. <sighs> a total waste of time. He kept going on about how he wanted inner beauty in a woman, and then I asked him about his divorce, and he was like, oh, my wife gained too much weight after menopause. Maybe you should take a break from dating, do some volunteering at the shelter. You know, cats, they lower your blood pressure. Thanks, but um, I'd like to find him while my eggs are still viable. I'll lend you the money to freeze your eggs. Let's go together. I can't. Not this weekend. Brad and I are moving in together. Oh. Yeah, we just decided, so I have to get all my stuff out by Saturday. Can I have my phone back? What are you doing now? I'm asking him out for tonight. Vodka infused portobello with fresh rutabaga puree and hand picked octopus tips with seasonal seaweed medley. Bon appetit. Jeez, you're hard to impress, huh? Anyways, I didn't want to put any provocative pictures on catch, but I do have a six pack. Thanks, but I don't like beer. <laughs> okay. Honey, I was trying to say that I'm ripped. And if you want to see it with your own eyes, I have a room reserved upstairs. Can't believe you had the nerve to say that to you on the first date. <sighs> the photo looked like him. But the second he opened his mouth, I knew it was a mistake. I'm telling you, you need to take a break. You just want me to go to the pet shelter. Carl called me. They need a lot of help right now. Someone dropped off 23 cats last week. How did they get there? Their owner died. She had no kids. A cat lady. That's exactly what I'm trying to avoid becoming.
Oh no. Lunch date? Mm-hmm. You waste no time. Does it even look like him? I don't know. He doesn't have a photo. What? I don't think that he's the type of guy that would post a photo. Like he's too good looking and he doesn't want to attract the wrong type of woman. Forever young? You do know what that means, right? Grandpa. Whatever. I just have a really good feeling about this one. Like, he could really get me. My work, my paintings. I just hope you're meeting him in a well-lit public place. <sighs> hey, that's a like dating 101. And then with his last breath, the old man says, One last lawyer. <laughs> 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 I gotta say, I was surprised you responded to my ad. I know, right? <laughs> I liked your tagline. Some like it hot. Marilyn. There'll never be another one like her. Marilyn Monroe? <laughs> well, I get it now. A beautiful angel. God loaned us for 36 years. You looking for her? He's dead. Although sometimes I think... Oh, never mind. Anyway, I am open to any possibilities. I love women. All women. Any shape, any age, whatever. I think women are God's gift to men. So, what do you think? Do I have a chance? Well, you are funny. And you've certainly made me laugh. But I think I'm also looking for someone else. I mean, come on, Larry. You could be my father. I could adopt you. Exactly on the other side of the world. And why do you think he's there? Because that's just my luck. So I take it your lunch date was not a success. Who's this? Larry Miller, a 63-year-old unemployed accountant. Didn't Carol say she was looking for an accountant? Isn't she also divorced? Thanks for dragging me here. You see, isn't this great? With all this cuteness around, it is impossible to think about any annoying stuff going on. Like Brad's mom being totally insane. Yeah. Besides, it's like I said, right? Everything happens for a reason. You know, he could even be here today. Who's that? I don't know. I am going crazy. I am 
so sorry I have not made enough time for us. What do you name him? Sam. Why Sam? I don't know. It just sort of came to me while I was looking at him. We could put a flyer here. Oh yeah. Excuse me, uh, I'd like to post one of these flyers. I know. I serve you your coffee every day. 